In week three of fall ball, cuts to the team continue as Coach Halawati searches for the best team available. What started with 60 players has been thinned down to approximately 45. One player still in the hunt is transfer catcher from Bergen County Community College, Aaron Kane. It's obviously my first year here at MSU. I'm um, just getting used to everything, meeting the guys, you know, having a great time playing, uh, slowly becoming, you know, part of the family, things like that, seeing how things work, and then, you know, out here playing baseball, having some fun. Definitely, you know, focused on being quick behind the plate, you know, trying to be a leader on the field, uh, taking charge, you know, making sure everybody's where they got to be, uh, getting corralling the pitcher staff, uh, making sure, you know, they, they got what they need, and also up at the plate, you know, hitting, picking out a good pitch to hit. Um, and just, you know, waiting for years and uh, taking advantage of it when you get it. Another transfer player looking to make an impact on the field is utility player Joe Foote. I've been uh, mostly working on uh, second base. That's where he, uh, coach has me right now. Uh, I look to compete every day at that position. Fall ball is all about the fundamentals, I think. I think uh, fall ball, you're working on uh, what you're least great at or you need to work on to get better at it for the spring. Fall ball isn't just for newcomers to the team. Nobody is guaranteed a spot when it comes to roster cuts. With few chances left to impress, every play counts for these hopefuls. Over the next two weeks, Coach Halawati will make the last cuts and find his 2016 baseball team.